What's going on, people? Yeah, it's time to this. The strongest, craziest steam junkie pre-workouts going into 2024, people. It's been a year since I did the previous list. There's some newcomers to this list, people. Yeah. And as usual, we're not doing them ranked by one by one because that doesn't make any freaking sense. Listen, people, this is a long list. There's more than 10. There's four categories. Let's get right into them. Okay, people, so as you know, on this channel, we don't do the list like, you know, from 10 to one, and there's one that's the best just because there's no one that's the best. The way that we do it here, definitely for the Steam Junkie category, but also for the everyday pre-workout category, which I'm going to do a separate video on, I'm going to rank them into categories, right? So we're going to have four categories. We're going to have aggressive energy Steam Junkie pre-workouts. We're going to have happy mood elevation Steam Junkie pre-workouts. We're going to have focus in the zone Steam Junkie pre-workouts. And then we're going to have the best Steam Junkie pre-workouts for people who are looking to get swole and feel the pump. Yeah, Steam Junkie pre-workouts with pumps. Now, each and every one of these pre-workouts that I'm going to take you through has a bit of the other stuff also, right? It doesn't mean that a Steam Junkie pre-workout that has pumps doesn't, it's not going to get your mood elevation up. Uh, steam Junkie that's happy doesn't mean that some of you guys might not feel aggressive mood elevation with it. But the ones that I'm going to take you through excel in that specific area. So you know what to expect. And you know, we are Steam Junkies. We like to cycle around. We like to have different feelings. Sometimes we's, we're more in the aggressive mode. Sometimes we want to just dance and be happy, right? Like more mood elevation, the happiness kind of mood elevation. Sometimes we want to get in the zone. Anyway, people. You get my drift. In this list here, there's more than 10, but not a lot more than 10, but there's more than 10. And by the way, this was really hard to put together a list that doesn't have like 50 different pre-workouts because there's so many great ones there. Another thing I just want you to make sure that you know is that I didn't put into this list pre-workouts that are actually very hard to find on a consistent basis just because they're usually out, right? And I'm gonna mention them maybe at the end as honorable mention. So if you actually ran into them, give them a shot, but they're just not available on a consistent basis. There's a lot of newcomers to this list. There's also pre-workouts that were on the list uh, getting into 2023 because they're still great. Now, as usual, some of the pre-workouts on this list might not be here for 2025. Yeah, just the nature of the beast. The FDA, who obviously has nothing better to do, sometimes messes with this shit. Listen, people, let's get into this. So the first category I have for you is aggressive energy. So the pre-workouts in this category are the ones that slap you really hard and keep you in an energy, aggressive energy, aggressive mood elevation. They also bring everything else. But listen, people, if you want to feel angry energy, angry mood elevation, mood elevation can be a lot of different things. So, okay, people, the first one on this list is Assassin V8, mm, Apollo Nutrition. Man, oh man, this one will slap you, get you in the zone, and man, aggressive energy, very aggressive energy. Assassin has always made my list, but very interesting, it made my list in different categories because Robic from Apollo Nutrition changes the formula all the time, and it just feels different. Once, I mean, there was a happy Assassin, believe it or not, right? Now we have this Assassin V8, which is aggressive energy. The second one, in the aggressive energy is Euphoria. That's a newcomer to this list, actually a newcomer to the supplement world. And man, Euphoria, this thing slaps you, you feel everything coming together, super aggressive mood elevation. You get in the zone, man, for some of you it might be too hard. It hits you like a train. And then some beautiful pre-workout though. If you're looking for aggressive energy, Euphoria by Star Labs, I think it's Star Labs Nutrition. Man, this thing delivers. The last two in this category are actually from the same brand and I'm going to have multiple uh, products from this brand on this list just because I have so many Steam Junkie pre-workouts. The next one is Crack Gold. Yeah, listen, I don't know if Crack Gold is going to be available throughout the year. It's actually already quite hard to get to. But listen, Crack Gold, it's been around for probably three years. This is one, if you're looking for something that will smack the living shit out of you, get you in a zone, an aggressive workout, mood elevation, just like so much going on with Crack Gold. This thing is an all-time favorite, super aggressive, obviously with DMAA, one of the only two or three, three, 
three pre-workouts on this list with, that still even say DMAA. Not going to be there for a long time. Anyway, Crack Gold, definitely one of the more aggressive energy pre-workouts out there. Beautiful pre-workout. If you haven't tried, give it a shot. The next one on this list is actually Crack the OG. This is the new pre-workout from uh, Dark Labs. Uh, maybe the one that will last after the DMAA shit is gone. Actually seems like it, to be honest. Very different design. It looks like this. This one is also, man, this one is almost on the verge. And the reason I have it last between my aggressive energy list and the happy mood elevation list is because it sort of sits in between. If you take one and a half scoop, it's going to be very aggressive. If you take one scoop or one rounded scoop, then crack the OG is almost happy mood elevation euphoria. Man, most of you, some of you will feel this a bit different, so that's why I have it on the verge. But listen, crack the OG. It's DMHA, not DMAA. This thing delivers. If you're, again, if you want to experiment with aggressive and happy, check out crack the OG. So this is it for the aggressive energy list. Yeah, I have four there. Let's get into the next one. The next one is the happy mood elevation. Yeah. So the pre-workouts on this part of the list are the ones that will get you dancing. The ones that if you woke up in the morning and there's something on your head, like you're not feeling that good, these things will elevate your mood elevation. Now, they also feel a bit different. And I, listen, these pre-workouts, they all feel a bit different. So even though they are in the same category, they feel different. I'll try to explain what's different about them. But I'm also going to link below to the full reviews. So you can watch the full review and decide for yourself. The first one there is hybrid pre-workout. This is the second here. Hybrid is there. By the way, I'm not sure for how long it will stay there because rumor is they're changing the formula. So if they are, I'm sorry. If, you, if they didn't yet, go give it a shot. It's a DMHA pre-workout. Man, hybrid will make you happy. Like it's just like, by the way, no alpha yo, no nothing. It just gets you in the zone, feel good, happy mood elevation, solid pumps. Such a beautiful pre-workout. It's not overwhelming, no heart rate going up, no survival mode. Beautiful, beautiful pre-workout for happiness. By the way, all the pre-workouts that I mentioned in the first list in the aggressive have alpha yo, alpha yo. The second one on this list does have alpha yo, but man, this is one of the most euphoric pre-workouts out there, flame by Dark Labs. No beta analyst, you're not gonna get the tingling, no pump formula whatsoever, but man, the euphoria is so apparent. And this thing will, it's not happy like smiling, it's aggressive happy, but man, the euphoria is so good. I love flame, like flame hits you so nice. It's very similar to crack the OG on one scoop, to be honest, just crack the OG as beta alanine and a pump for and the entire shenanigan. Flame though, pure euphoria, beautiful and appetite suppression galore. By the way, also crack the OG that I mentioned in the aggressive energy list, people. The next one here is Wildfire by SoCal Supplements. Yeah, newcomer to this list. Also claims DMAA on the label. Listen, this is a great pre-workout. Also no alpha yo, so this one, or at least doesn't feel like there's any alpha yo there. So there's no drama with this pre-workout. Very sustained energy, lasts for a long time, and puts you in such a good place mood elevation wise. Very, very similar to hybrid. I would put them in the same category. Feels good. By the way, it has a sister product, Cerberus, which I really like. It's an awesome. I didn't put it in this list, but I actually just talked about it. Listen, very similar feeling. Love Cerberus also. But anyway, Wildfire, it's, D, it's uh, DMA, DMHA, I think, Cerberus. They feel very much the same. Wildfire, amazing pre-workout. If you haven't tried it and you want to feel like that mood elevation in the zone with a bad hanging thing and with no drama, check out Wildfire. The next one in the happy feel good is Chaotic Rage by Madhouse Innovation. Also a newcomer to this list, just a feel good, happy pre-workout. Yeah, with just everything you need in a pre-workout to feel good, to experiment with, really like it. It's one that I always feel very comfortable going to. Sort of replaced uh, God of Rage, the DMHA version for me, which by the way, sometimes you can still find it. If you haven't tried it, give it a shot. But it's like that sort of feeling, just an overall feeling good, even though it's a steam junkie, it's a very strong pre-workout, you just feel good and happy. So the next category is in the zone steam junkie pre-workout. So these pre-workouts excel on the focus side. Now, are you gonna get happy or mood elevation? Yeah, you're gonna feel euphoric. Are you gonna get pumps? And with some of them, you're gonna get pumped. But the, the main thing there, they claim to fame, is the focus and in the zone. I have three for you. Another Dark Labs pre-workout, crack, the original crack, the purple one with DMAA, probably not gonna last for a long time. My guess is that this is the last year that Crack Gold and Crack uh, 
the original Dark Labs Crack DMAA are, are available. So anyway, focus, pumps, in the zone, such a beautiful experience. People, there's just no way you're not gonna like Crack from Dark Labs. This thing is like a steam junkie staple, right? Now, is it gonna hit you, slap you, move you around, aggressive? It's not an aggressive one, it's actually in the zone, feel good, pre-workout with solid pumps, by the way. The second one on this list is Smash AMF. If you can still find the original uh, batch from Smash AMF, man, oh man. This one has something in it that's not on label. The focus on Smash AMF, even on three quarters of a scoop or on one scoop or a rounded scoop, it really depends on your tolerance, man. The focus is just insane. The appetite suppression is for days and the energy lasts for such a long time. It is, listen, it's an experience. Now, the formula might change when, when you're watching this one, because again, with these things that have shit that's not on label, it tends to change. But if, if it didn't, if you can still find the original batch, man, Smash AMF is a keeper, right? This one is different. The next one on this list, the third one, and the last one on this part, on the In The Zone Steam Junkie pre-workouts, Crack Primal, yes, another Dark Labs. This and Crack Primal, I didn't even know where to put it because I could as easily put it in the happy one, I could as easily put it in the aggressive one, and I can as easily put it here in the in the zone. It's just it's a beautiful all-around Dark Labs pre-workout. It's just a beautiful experience. It hits you just strong enough. You know these pre-workouts that slap you and you're saying, please don't be stronger, and they're not. And it puts you in such a good place and you're just in the zone and you're working out, working out. I love Crack Primal. If you can get your hands on it, give it a shot. I'm gonna link, by the way, to all of these reviews below, also to where you can find deals, coupons, save some money while supporting the channel. Let's get into the last category, which is Steam Junkie pre-workouts that excel with pumps. Now, these two that I have here, listen to this. They're not just about pumps. They're about in the zone. Some, uh, you can arguably say, put them in the in the zone category. You could put them in the mood elevation category, happy or aggressive. But listen, pumps, Steam Junkie pre-workouts not necessarily always are very good with pumps. So these two, the pumps, even though they are Steam Junkie pre-workouts, are amazing. The first one on this list is the Apollo Nutrition Hooligan. Man, listen, first, focus. Easily I could put Hooligan in the in the zone Steam Junkie category. 650 milligrams of caffeine. Amazing pump formula. This shit will get you pumped and energized for a day. Like, man. This shit will keep you focused for a day. This thing is a Steam Junkie pre-workout, but the pumps are insane for a Steam Junkie pre-workout. The second one on this list is the Hypermax 3D by Performax Labs. This is a beautiful pre-workout. One of these pre-workouts you can always go to, take it. There's no way in hell you're going to be disappointed. It's going to put you in the zone. It's going to put you in a, mood, in a great mood. You're going to be working out. You're going to go set to set. It's going to feel relatively healthy for a Steam Junkie pre-workout. The, man, the pumps are insane on Performax Labs Cybermax. So again, if you're looking for a Steam Junkie pre-workout that excel with pumps and there's not a lot of them, check out these two, Hooligan and Performax Lab Hypermax. There's also Hypermaxed Out, which is a stronger version. On, it's, it feels like a more aggressive version of Hypermax. It's a limited edition. If you can still fight it, give it a shot. Also, the pumps there are amazing. Listen, people, that's it for the list. Like I mentioned, there's a couple that are not on this list just because they're not available most of the time. Like M2, which I would definitely put in the happy pre-workout category. Mind Muscle Nutrition, if you can find it, give it a shot. There's a bunch of others. Listen, there's so many pre-workouts out there. This list would take days. I'm trying to put it in categories so you know what to expect. I'm gonna to link to all of these reviews below. All of these reviews below. We do a lot of reviews. I'm gonna to link to these reviews below. I'm gonna to link to deals on Fitness Deal News so you can save some money while supporting the channel. And yeah, people, enjoy your Steam Junkie journey into 2024. I'll see you at the beginning of 2025. Man, this, we've, we've been blessed. Listen, there's so many pre-workouts. There's so much stuff around so you can experiment. I'm gonna do more lists here. I'm gonna do an everyday pre-workout list. I'm gonna do a Steam Free pre workout list, I'm going to do a fat burner list, and I'm going to do a nootropic list, and maybe I'll do other lists. If you have any idea for a list, let me know. Listen, people, hopefully this list was helpful. Give it a thumbs up. Give the video a thumbs up and subscribe to the channel if you're new here, because this is what we do. We give you our honest, unbiased freaking opinion. Yeah.